Collective research. Active fundamental research in global capital markets. Make informed decisions. In a road bicycle race, the peloton is the main group or pack of riders. Riders in a group save energy by riding close to other riders. The reduction in drag is dramatic. Riding in the middle of a well-developed group. Drag can be reduced to as little as 5 to 10 percent. Exploitation of this potential energy saving leads to complex cooperative and competitive interactions between riders and teams in race tactics. The term is also used to refer to the community of professional cyclists in general. Sales growth. Sales have shown a fluctuating trend over the past five years, with a significant increase in 2022, followed by a decline in 2023. Net income. Net income has been consistently negative over the past five years, indicating that the company has not been generating profits. Operating income. Operating income has also been negative, suggesting that the company's core operations are not profitable. Total assets. Total assets have shown a fluctuating trend over the past five years, with a significant increase in 2022 followed by a decline in 2023. Total liabilities. Total liabilities have generally increased over the years, indicating growing obligations. A significant increase in liabilities in 2022 might have contributed to the rise in the debt-equity ratio during that period. Debt-equity ratio. A negative ratio in 2023 suggests an unusual situation where total equity is greater than total debt. In 2022, the debt-equity ratio was significantly positive, 2.6337, indicating a higher reliance on debt financing relative to equity. In 2021, the ratio was 0.4731, indicating a moderate level of leverage. Quick ratio. A quick ratio of 1.43 in 2023 indicates that the company has $1.43 in liquid assets for every $1 of short-term liabilities. The quick ratio has been generally increasing, suggesting improved short-term liquidity compared to previous years. Current ratio. A current ratio of 2.12 in 2023 means the company has $2.12 in current assets for every $1 in current liabilities. The current ratio has shown some fluctuations but remains above 1, indicating a generally healthy ability to cover short-term obligations. Net profit margin. A negative net profit margin indicates that the company is incurring losses. Investors generally look for positive and stable net profit margins. Asset turnover. Asset turnover measures how efficiently a company utilizes its assets to generate revenue. A higher asset turnover is generally preferred. Equity multiplier. The equity multiplier shows the financial leverage of the company. A higher equity multiplier indicates higher financial leverage. Operating profit margin. This metric provides insights into the operating efficiency of the company. A negative operating profit margin suggests operating losses. Rho, return on equity. Rho is the ultimate measure of a company's profitability. In this case, the negative row indicates that the company is not generating profits from its operations and is heavily leveraged. Peloton is a bad investment. Consistently negative net income and operating income. Peloton has reported negative net income and operating income for the past five years. This consistent loss-making trend raises concerns about the company's ability to generate profits from its core operations. Leverage and debt equity ratio. The debt-equity ratio has shown significant fluctuations, including a negative ratio in 2023. The negative ratio and the previously high positive ratio in 2022 suggest an unusual and potentially concerning financial structure. High reliance on debt financing can increase financial risk, especially when combined with negative profitability. Negative return on equity, ROE, and operating profit margin. The negative row indicates that the company is not generating profits from its operations relative to shareholders' equity. The negative net profit margin and operating profit margin further highlight operational challenges, as the company is incurring losses rather than making profits. Operational challenges. The negative net profit margin, operating profit margin, and row suggest operational challenges. Investors should carefully assess the company's business model, cost structure, and ability to turn around its operations. If you would like us to research a stock, 
please tweet at Collective ReC or leave a comment here. Like and subscribe for potential investment ideas. Become a member at www.collective-research.com. Receive investment ideas before they are published. Collective research. Active fundamental research in global capital markets. Make informed decisions.